Hi, welcome back to my channel, The Teaspoon. My name is Tony, and today we're going to be having another aged Puar tasting. And this time we're going to be drinking a 2009 aged Yi um, Puar from Tea Urchin. And let's take a look at, look at the box. It's a really nice box. And now we're going to do an unboxing. Okay, let's just do the unboxing here. Oh, wow. And it yields the tea cake in the middle. So the tea cake, it says, is from a thousand year tree, which is not correct. It's just marketing hype. And I'm just going to put this box away. And let's open this up. And reveal, wow, look at this. The leaves are very dark. It's a mixture of you know buds and those fine picking leaves, and it's the, the color is dark. It means it is age. It's 2009. So we're 11 years old, and I am going to. Okay, I'm just gonna get use my trusty pour pick. I'm gonna get five grams. Four. Okay, maybe six grams. Six grams of leaf. And let's take a look at the broken leaves. Okay, I'm just gonna put everything away. Came back and we're ready to taste the leaves. Before we do that, let's smell the dry leaf. So the predominant smell I'm getting is a little bit of the some minty, a little minty, very sweet, typical of the Wii Yu, Yi Wu, pours, and a little bit of you know those peach notes. Okay, all the parameters will be in the description below, as always. Giving this a quick rinse. Okay, going ready for the first steep. And I did also buy a 2013 Snake Yi Wu blend, which I already tried, and that one's very delicious. That video will be posted sometime later in the future. Okay, let's just smell the dry wet leaves. Mmm. I'm getting some apricots, some sweetness, like a little bit of honey, and then a little bit of like a medicinal herb smell. Let's see how it tastes. And see the color of the liqueur. It's kind of a bright orange. Mmm. Sweet, very it's floral notes, a little bit, a little medicinal. Hmm. And you have that Yang Shen cooling sensation. Hmm. There's no bitterness at all. It's not astringent at all. Mm. It's 
good Yiwu, but it's not very interesting. It's very not many things going on. Unlike the snake blend. Hmm. So I'm just waiting for my second steep. <laughs> the color, these, these look really nice. Second steep is ready. Color of the second steep is much, much darker. It's a brighter. See? Yep, it's just bright orange. And let's see how it tastes. Mm. It's sweeter. Still has a medicinal note, and that young still has some of that young raw shen taste, the cooling sensation. But it's not harsh at all, like a really young shen. It's not astringent. No bitterness. No astringency. The mouthfeel is kind of medium, light to medium. Hmm. It's not a bad shin. Okay, and we'll be right back and see how many steep skin does T go for. Okay, I'm back and I was able to get seven good steepings of this tea. And so it does transform a little bit. The first couple of steeps, it's uh, sweet, sweeter, medicinal, a little bit of that H taste, and a little bit of that Shen. It's still kind of relatively young Shen, and that shows itself, that cooling sensation in steeps 3 to 5, and 6 is something eases off and becomes just a little sweeter. And so who do you think, I think this um, tea is good for? This tea is good for beginners, because this Shen is very approachable. It's not, it doesn't have the harshness of the younger Shens it does. It has, but, and it's not bitter. It's only a little bit bitter if you overbrew it, but no astringency at all. And yeah, for veterans, I think you should get something more interesting. This tea is not really complex. Not many notes, just like, you know, those stone fruit notes, classic yiwu, stone fruit sweetness, honey. Um, and uh, that's about it. And for, as far as value goes, this tea is a roughly $80 USD, which is about 100 and ten dollars canadian so yeah for that price point it's not bad but i would actually buy the more premium version the snake the snake blend 2013 that one is delicious and i think i should have bought a cake of that instead but anyways that video will be again posted sometime in the future thank you for watching and i hope uh, you like this content please give it a thumbs up if you like it and remember to subscribe for any future content and that's it until we tea again thank you